Let's go watch it in 2D. No, let's go watch it in 3D. But if we watch it in 3D, then is it worth the cost? So, James, we're doing something special this time around. and um, All right. What are we going to do? So, last year, on episode two of Death 3D Show, we had... A, you know, best of the year awards. Ah, yes, the and, best um, of the year awards. Th- that title kind of sucked. <laughs> <laughs> best of the year award. What's wrong with it? It's just it's it was not... the best of the year. You know, it, it's simple, but you know what? We're actually going to do a real. Um, I, I give a good name to this thing, and All uh, right. a real award, and I actually made a graphic. And it's like golden 3D glasses. And um, so this is going to be the 3D or 2D.com's 2015, the three-dimensional awards for outstanding excellence. Wow. So um, this is going to be the nomination uh, podcast. We're gonna the have... nomination. How how many categories are there? Oh, it's quite a few, and th- some of them are fun. And they're not just uh, super serious, and of course, you know, we're unlike the Oscars. We're going to do something special. James, all right. Do you want to know how special this is going to be? How special are we going to be? We're going to have you know, obviously, my vote, your vote, and Kristen, which is another um, you know contributor to what 3 d com vote. And yes. Um, so what makes this special, James, is that this is going to be open to the public to vote. I created a Google form, which will – the link will be provided in the RSS feed notes, and uh, the people could click on it and vote as long as they have a Google account. The Google account is only there just to limit one vote per person. Um, so you could actually edit it after you do post it if you feel like you really need to change it. But – uh, you just have the Google form, and all the nominees will be there, and you could vote for it. So we'll have mm. a user picked, you know, fans pick. They're gonna pick uh, their choice too. So we'll have our pick, and we'll have the fan pick. Obviously, I made the nominations. These are gonna be the nominations. Um, and uh, click on which one you want to win. And that's something the Oscars don't do. They don't care what the regular people f- care about. I do. And the best part, James, is that this is open to anyone in the world. On March 1st will be the cutoff date. So after March 1st, 2016, um, any votes will not be counted. So March 1st ending in Central Standard Time of America. So at midnight, March 1st, 2016, going to March 2nd, 2016, that will be a cutoff. But anyone in the world can vote. So I have... All right. Yeah. So that's a, a nice twist, you know. That's a neat. That's a that's a neat way to spin it. And yeah, you know, it's 2016's a, a election year, and people are gonna vote for president, and they're also gonna vote for 3D movie stuff. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. So um, let's right. get started with the nominations. Uh, best 3D movie of the year, 2015. I'm gonna have these four movies be nominated: The Walk, The Martian. Star Wars 7, episode, uh, The Force Awakens, and Avengers... Also known as Episode 4, Part 2. And Avengers Age of Ultron. Ooh. I know a lot of people really don't like Age of Ultron as much as the original, but we disagree. <laughs> yes. All right, so best 3DS game, mm. uh, The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D, Story of Seasons... And Brown Plus. Now, the 3DS kind of had a weak year, so um, yeah, it's didn't true. Have that many? We all know which yeah. one's gonna win. <laughs> you never know. You never know. Well, I'm just saying. You know. Okay. So here's the more pronounced 3D nominations. Um, overall best use of 3D depth. And I have three nominations here for Ant Man. The Walk, and Prown Plus for 3DS. Cool. Um, I got overall best use of pop-out 3D. 
Mm. So we got Jurassic World. Ooh, that one's great. SpongeBob, Sponge Out of Water. <laughs> Mad Max Fury Road. Mm, I know what I'm thinking. Okay. So we got another one here. Best overall 3D in a movie. So you can have good pop and good depth and overall good how they do it. So the nominations are Everest, Jurassic World, The Walk, Pan, SpongeBob, Sponge Out of Water, Mad Max Fury Road. Okay. So the next one up is Best Overall 3D in a 3DS Game. And the nominations are The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D, Prawn Plus, and Gunslugs 2. All right. Best Animated 3D Movie of 2015. We got Home. We got Inside Out. We got The Peanuts Movie and The Good Dinosaur. All right. Biggest Disappointment of 2015. Now, this is a juicy one. Mm. The pathetic, exclusive new 3DS game lineup and support. <laughs> the Legend of Zelda Triforce Heroes. <laughs> Hotel Transylvania 2. <laughs> Metroid Prime Federation Forces. <laughs> <laughs> that one's the best one. And the storyline of Jurassic World. <laughs> All right. Biggest 3D surprise of 2015. Mad Max Fury Road. Huge box office for Jurassic World. The high quality of Marvel Netflix TV shows, including Daredevil and Jessica Jones. And Nintendo to start developing mobile games in the near future. Hmm. The worst movie of the year 2015. You ready for this? All right. SpongeBob, Sponge Out of Water. <laughs> Jupiter Ascending. Oh, no. Bad one. Poultry Guys, the remake. And uh, Minions. <laughs> Surprise, the obvious one's not there. <laughs> um, worst 3DS game of the year. Angry Video Game Nerd Adventures. Dr. Mario Miracle Cure and The Legend of Zelda Triforce Heroes. Now, The Legend of Zelda Triforce Heroes I actually haven't reviewed on the site and um, there's going to be a reason for that. So that's part of the reason why it's on these lists. Um, yes. Worst 3D usage. Dr. Mario Miracle Cure Best of Solitaire Inside Best Out. Best solid. And uh, Hotel Transylvania 2. Okay. okay. Here is a mes most memorable movie performance in 2015. Now, this is going to be a much more interesting uh, thing than uh, um, the Oscars because I do not discriminate unless the, uh, <laughs> I like every kind of race and gender and even robots. I will allow any kind of performance to be in this no, uh, category, rather be motion capture or robot or whatever. So I do not discriminate. But here are the nominees for most memorable movie performance. Joseph Gordon-Levitt portraying Philippe Petit in The Walk. Mark Watney played by Mar Matt Damon in The Martian. Owen, played by Chris Pratt in Jurassic World. Lewis, played by Michael Pena in Ant-Man. Furiosa, by Charisse Theron in Mad Max Fury Road. The droid BB-8 in Star Wars Episode 7: The Force Awakens. <sighs> Finn, by John Bagoya in Star Wars Episode 7: The Force Awakens. Ray by Daisy Ridley in Star Wars 7 The Force Awakens and Immortan Joe by Hugh K from Mad Max Fury Road Most underappreciated movie of 2015 Pan, The Good Dinosaur San Andreas 
Hmm. Best 3D action movie. Avengers Age of Ultron. Ant-Man. San Andreas. Mad Max Fury Road. And Jurassic World. Best Amiibo released in 2015. Mr. Game & Watch. Rob the Robot. Super Mario 8-Bit Retro Color. Mega Yarn Yoshi. Mega Man. Captain Olimar. Best use of 3D in a very specific movie scene. Now, um, so obviously there's kind of spoilers, but you can't really talk about this without spoiling things, so heads up. The raptor hunting down the Indominus Rex in Jurassic World. The scene with Philip walking between the Twin Towers in the walk. The bubble superhero fight scene in Spongebob, Sponge Underwater. The Martian Storm in The Martian. The epic climax crash scene in Mad Max Fury Road. And the scene with the fairies flying around in Neverland in Pan. Favorite 2D only movie of the year, Ex Machina or The Big Short. Worst 2D only movie of the year, Fifty Shades of Grey, Fantastic Four. And best 2D only game, Super Mario Maker, Yoshi's Woolly World, and Citizens of Earth. So, those are the nominations, and um, we're going to, sometime in March, um, talk about the actual winners. And I'm going to have enough time uh, all of month of February to v- the people to vote on the different categories. So, if you want, it's like, I want to nominate something else. So I will have a other box that you could check and you could comment there on the uh, Google form so you could pick whatever you want to put in there. Just type it in and, um, you know, um, I would suggest you put it in English because I can't read any other languages. Um, But if you want to pick other things that I did not list, you have the option to just click the other button and put comment in there and put what you want. So if you want to be a troll and just put butts on other and butts are your vote for everything you know you could do that i really hope you don't waste your time putting that but whatever you know if i missed a important thing you could find it and you could comment and add it so i gave you that option on the google form so we're gonna have you know editor's choice um and we're gonna have of course fan choice so yeah, and these are the nominations for the three-dimensional awards for outstanding excellence. Do you have any final words, James? Nope, not really. So the entire list will be on the website, uh, 3D or 2D.com. I will include it in the RSS notes, and um, I also include um, the direct link so you can go ahead and vote in the RSS notes. So that's going to be it for this little mini podcast for the awards, first annual 3D awards for outstanding achievement thank you for listening bye later okay so that's going to conclude the podcast remember to rate this podcast on itunes and on stitcher radio also remember to follow us at 3d or 2d.com on twitter and facebook and instagram please comment on the website and subscribe to us on youtube finally i hope you enjoyed the show and thank you for listening Bye. Bye.